Hello, welcome to Maths with J. So here we want to use the remainder theorem to find the remainder when we're dividing a polynomial by a linear factor. So let's just write down the general format of the remainder theorem. So the important thing is that when we divide a polynomial f of x by x minus a, the remainder is simply the value that we get when we substitute a into the polynomial. So that's f of a. So let's just explain why that would be. And it's because we can write the polynomial as something or other multiplied by x minus a plus a remainder. And then the really important thing is what we do next. When we put x equal to a, then all we're left with, if you think about it, is whatever the quotient is, multiplying, and this is the really important thing, the quotient multiplies zero. So of course, all that bit just disappears and all we're left with is the remainder. So that we know that f of a is the remainder. So in the case that we're looking at here, if we write down f of x as our polynomial, all we need to do is work out the value of it when we put x equal to 3. So let's do that. So all we need to do is first of all write down what f of x is. So that's 2x cubed plus 5x squared minus 28x and plus 5. And we want to work out the remainder, which we'll find by replacing x by 3. So that's going to be 2 times 3 cubed plus 5 times 3 squared minus 28 times 3 plus 5. And that will work out to be 20. So when we divide the polynomial by x minus 3, we get a remainder of 20.